Hello everybody, my name is Mike from Mad Gaming, and welcome back to Simulacra. Now, I think we're getting fairly close to an ending of sorts. We've got to try and bribe, or blackmail, should I say, a co-worker of Anna's, Merv, who, who's a creepy bastard. And we managed to find out some of Taylor and Greg's dark past, as in, they're both dickheads. But okay, let's talk to Merv. Greetings, Merv. We're going to try and um, blackmail this bastard because we need to get into her computer. Anna, where have you been? Everyone's been looking for you. I need a favor. Anything for you, baby. You never asked anything from me before. What gives? Can you restore my phone data from my PC? Let's be straight, straight shooter. Using another employee's PC is against policy. Why can't you do it yourself? I have to attend a family emergency. Apply to his sense of... That can't be right. Shit. You're not Anna, aren't you? Fuck, I should have known. Okay, we're done. Do you want me to leak your dirty emails? Ha 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 ha, now we got him. Blackmail? Is that what's happening? Yes, that is what's happening. You know I can get sued for sharing company secrets, right? If you still want access to Anna's computer, I'm not doing it. How about I send your emails to HR? How about that? No, 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 no. Okay, I'll do it. <laughs> we got him. We got him by the short and curlies. It's hard to hold this job in the economy as it is. I need to get a password reset for her PC. But HR will text her phone to verify. You will have to pretend to be Anna, otherwise they will never give me access. I'm a pro. I've been... No, I'm actually not a pro. You've done this before. Jeez. Just make it quick, okay? Okay. Elizabeth, HR. Got your password request, but I didn't see you in today. Is everything okay? Oh, God. I was in and out of the bathroom. If you're not feeling well, just take the day off, okay? Before I reset your password, can I run something by you first? Anything. You gotta, you know, just be, you know. You know the report you handed to me last week? I finally got to it. Oh, that, I almost forgotten about it. It's a pretty big deal. It's not something you should forget. It says here that you are making an official sexual harassment report against Merv. Yep, that's the one. I brought this up with my manager. And he told me to tell you seriously to think about this. Our company can't afford to get into a scandal right now. And sending lewd emails, while technically is reportable, it is one of the, uh, the smaller... Oh, right. I don't like to do this, but we need to get that password. And we're already blackmailing him. All right, dot, dot, dot. His words, not mine. So he suggests you drop the report while he will have a talk with Merv. Put it all behind and he might approve that study leave you've been meaning to get. But if you want, you can still let the report go through. Forcing Mr. Maraday's hand is just going to upset him. Oh, God. Justice is more important. Well, we're already getting justice as it is, I think, at this point. Okay, hold back the report. All right. But if you ask me, you got to protect your own dignity. But I don't understand where you're coming from. Oops, almost forgot. I just reset your password. See you at the barbecue. Oh, okay, we've got it. Okay. Right, thank you. Right. Got the reset. And I'm in. Remember what you're here for, Merv, you dirty pervert. Yeah, yeah, get the phone back up, right? Give me a sec. Come on. Come on, Merv. It's starting now. Gonna take a while to complete. Right. I don't understand what's going on, but you're not the only one who wants access to this computer. There's someone else? Oh, it's gonna be Greg, isn't it? While I'm waiting for the reset... Some dude came by demanding to use Anna's computer. He caused quite a scene and security took him away. I think his name was Greg. Oh, Greg. Is he with you? I don't know that person. 
No, washing my hands of Greg. <laughs> Barging in here is a bad idea. Security won't let this go easily. Finally, it's done. Okay, so we made the right decision then. Okay, here we go. System restore. Restoring spark, restoring mail. Did you get it? Oh, he's gone. Do we not need to talk to him anymore then? I was going to say yes. Um. Okay. Oh, it's you again, is it? Hello, Ulna. Uh, have you found her yet? No, I haven't. But we're getting there, I think. Not yet. I'm not sure to trust this dude, you see. I don't think this is actually... She is running out of time. You need to hurry. You are not making this easy. Holding on to this is not easy. Spark is the answer. Oh, the answer is in Spark. Okay, yeah. The answer is in Spark. Yeah, we know that already. But that's where I was going before you decided to interrupt me. That's what I've been trying to do, mate. Her survival and many more depends on you. She met me. She met it. I'm not it. It is not me. Find me. Find it. Okay, so looking for Ulna, that person? Is she still alive? Time is short. If you fail, she will share my fate. Whoa, okay. So who is this, though? <laughs> Emoji! His eyes are opening wider. His eyes are opening. And then he dies. Okay. Thanks, Ulna. But yeah, that's the picture you showed me. What about it? That's what it's. Oh, nothing is what it seems, that says. Thank you for the. I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming this time. Okay, we've got a new vlog. Let's. Okay, Merv's talking to us, but let's have a look at this new vlog. Okay, look at this. Look at this crap. This entire email is in the subject line and it's all in caps. That's just rude. Like, internet rude. God, and my dumb colleague won't stop texting me. But would not. <laughs> oh God, I cannot wait to leave there and work with animals. Yeah, because animals don't treat me like garbage. Chimpanzees would. I'm still waiting on my vet school application though. Hope I get it. I hope you're alive. <laughs> That's more important. Okay, we've got three videos left. That's not many. Oh, she's smiling now, is she? Ha! <laughs> That's not creepy. Okay, weekly sparkles. Oh, I guess we should talk to Thingy first, shouldn't we? Oh god, Merv, here we go. Froze, did you get the backup? Yeah, I got it. I've done everything you've told me. Can I go now? I trust you're going to keep my chats with Anna a secret. <sighs> yeah, I think he's going to have words and i think this is far bigger than him as much as i would love to take this creep down yeah i think this may scare him i think this may scare him as long as you don't do it again if you do it again mate i will be on to you i promise you just keep me out of what you're doing oh that's that's fine i will don't you worry okay ashley we've got some recovered messages from ashley are we... Okay. 
Okay, yeah, Greg, you got arrested, mate, didn't you? Didn't you, you... You dickhead. Yeah, we'll get to you in a minute. I'm just going through recovered stuff. I will make your profile for you. Okay, so Ashley set up the spark. Okay. Come on, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fun. I'll take care of everything, okay? I'm gonna make your profile so good that even you would date yourself. And I think it's time to unleash the, hey, my eyes are up here dress. As hard as you, I'm going to wait patiently. Liar, lol, shut up, I'll leave you be. And that's the last she heard. Okay, well, we'll talk to Greg in a bit. Yo, I don't mean to rush, but it's been a while did the blackmailing work. Went perfectly. It's all sorted now. Noise. So, what did you find in the past Spark messages? I haven't looked yet. Just read all of them and find out exactly who, went, who Anna went to meet. Make sure you get all of them. I haven't read it yet. Getting there, right? Uh, isn't that what we came for? Yeah, I was getting there. Make sure you check out all the past Spark messages, especially the other guys. I'll wait till you're done. Creek. Hello, Creaky Creek. Right, okay. Fuck, shit! I think I'm in trouble. Went to Anna's workplace, something bad happened. Yeah, I heard. Yeah, fuck, I slipped up. How the heck I know that someone else would be at her computer? You could've asked me first, man. Why do I need permission for you to do anything? Because, too late for that now. This is real bad. The cops are involved now. Yeah, Merv made it really clear, apparently. That guy at Anna's desk. The hell is his deal? Looks like he had something shoved up his ass. Do me a favour. Don't get the cops involved anymore. I cannot get another target on me. I'll be arrested for sure. I I've not spoken to the cops yet, so at this point I've got no reason to drop Greg in it. If something happens to me, I'm dragging you down as well. I'm going to keep looking for Anna alone. Fine, you just stay quiet. Well, you're an asshole, but you're also trying to find Anna. As much as I'm not going to go out of my way to help you, at the same time... The sexual assault allegations against our tech director are unfounded due to lack of hard evidence. Bullshit! There we go. That's, that, that's what I had to say to that. Okay, let's go through the spark... Oh. James. Message corrupted. This is the dude. This is him. Look, that's the face, but it was a bit... Let me guess. Cat person. Too easy. I bet you're wrong half the time. Got it right every time so far. How many times is that? Once. Another spark newbie. Good thing you showed up. I was starting to get dull. What? Can't find any matches? For real, this is your first chance spark. I have some. But I mean one. That can't be true. It is. Cross my heart. What was wrong with her? I'd rather talk about you. Okay. So this is all fairly normal at the moment. Yep. So, surveillance tech. Finally, you don't seem like a techie. I'm not. How about you? I am a copywriter. Oh, it's Detective Morello! I'm not going to answer. I'm going to decline. I'll just leave it. I'm not getting the police involved. Decline. Shh. Bye. Bye bye police, you don't need to get involved. I got this sound I got this handled, man, I know what I'm doing. You wanna f go away. Oh, I've got it, 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 I've got it. I Go away! I am a copywriter making crappy stuff better. Oh. You're gonna have to answer it. Okay. Hello, can you hear me? Yes. This is Detective Marillo from the police department. Hello. Yeah. One of your colleagues reported that someone is attempting an unauthorized access to your work computer to retrieve some sensitive information. Right. This is a case of corporate espionage, and we have reason to believe that a man named Greg Summers is behind it. Okay. I'm informing you that your personal data has been compromised, and that Greg is now wanted for questioning. If you have any information on his whereabouts, please contact me on this number. 
Thank no, you and good day. we're not going to be doing that. Thank you very much. Greg's an asshole, but yeah. Yeah, okay. I am a copywriter making crappy stuff sound better than it looks. There we go. God, that was a tough one. That took me a while. Wow, there's a lot of correct data here. Do you want to just go away, Taylor? I am not leaving any stone unturned, mate. That's what I'm working on. Leave me alone. Okay, my position of fresh ideas is still open. Okay. Fresh ideas. Your problem are solutions. Okay. Spark is rebound city for most people. Yeah, okay. Are you stalking me? You have an unnatural talent of guessing my backstory. Didn't have to, Anna. You're an open book and so easy to read. Just connect the dots. Okay, smart guy. What else can you read? I think you should just take a break from everything. From the job you hate, from the previous guy, whatever happened. Take a vacay and start on you. That's so what I need right now. For a guy I barely met, how come you know so much about me? Call it intuition. So how much of an ass is he? Who? The guy you dumped. Really want to know? Let's trade. Tell me about this first spark girl. You really want to know? You started it. Fair enough. When I first started out... I matched with this girl named Cassie, also known as Keeping It Cassie. There we go. She's cool, but she's like big social media person or something. I'm not a fan of the attention. No way. So you passed a Jabba celeb? Are you even real? Told you too much attention. Right, okay. Some boy problems. Give you one guess. He cheated on you. Yep, typical. Were there any signs? That's the thing. None zero. I guess sometimes you can never tell. Is it just me? Am I blind? Hey, don't say that. Blah, blah, blah. Is it working? Something else. So she's getting all along with this guy. She was actually chatting with him quite a lot. She told him a lot of stuff. Okay. Okay. Tell you what. I'll teach you how to apply for colleagues like a pro. Isn't it just filling in forms? Hey, I'll write you a kick-ass application. How? Meet. Oh, hang on a minute. Meet me this weekend, and I'll show you. Okay. Smooth. <laughs> Fine, but you better actually be useful. I can think of a few things we can use. Ha, huh, like what? Depends on my mood. Fine, I'll find it myself. You're lucky. That's good timing for me. See you. See you soon. Be there in an hour. I'm here. Where are you? I see you. Oh, that's creepy. Okay, right. So that's it. Okay. And I met with James Ol Olner. That was the surname. James, huh? Sounds pretty normal, actually. And imagine the culprit to have a scarier name. What else you got? Uh, he's unnaturally good at guessing Anna's past. Yeah, he was really good at that. Sounds like stalker material to me. I wonder if there's any way to confirm this. Uh, he met Keeping It Cassie before Anna. No way. What player? She's like a Jabba celeb. I hope she's alright. She looks active on Jabba. If we could somehow talk to her, maybe she could share what she knows about him. And he works at a design firm called Fresh Ideas. It's a pretty cheesy name. Yeah, it is. Even for my taste. Yeah, and that's saying something, man. Maybe someone there could tell us what's up with him. Looks like we're going to have to start with this James fellow. It's close, I can feel it. Yeah, me too. I do feel like we are getting close to something. That's what I like to hear. You've got the most resources to figure out who this James person is. I think you need to track this Cassie person down and call his workplace. Dig a little more about him. I'll track Cassie first. Stop knocking at my door! As long as you do both, I'll leave it up to you. Oh, thanks, man. In the meantime, I'll give Spark a call. Maybe they have something on this James person. Okay, fine enough. If we're all working on this, then I think that's probably a good idea. Right, so she's a Jabba celebrity called Cassie. Can we find... What's this? Something to think about. Well, I'm not really that interested at the moment. Let's... 
see if we can find her. Ah, Cassie. Here we go. Keeping it Cassie. Here she is. Okay, so how do we... I check her profile? Right, okay. Here we go. Keep an eye on my upcoming posts. Find the hidden phone number. If you find it, I'll just call me. Okay. Nine in the morning. Why am I craving Chinese food? Two days in a row. Nine, two. Nine, two, three. Nine, two, three, eight. Nine, two, three, eight, one. Nine, two, three, eight, one, four. I'm going to have to write this down. Nine, two, three, eight. One four oh. Aha! Here we go. Hiya, this is Keepin' It Cassie. Congratulations! You figured out the secret number. Yay! As you know, you get to ask me one question for my upcoming AMA thread. So please be patient, as I will contact you on my next availability. We'll be texting you soon. Thank you, Cassie. Aha! Got your number. It's first come fist serve. So let me finish up with the early winners. I'll go back to you once I'm done. Can't wait. Really? Is that it? Okay, here we go. Hey, uh, you're up. It's your turn to AMA. Remember, you only get one question. I'll keep it to one. Awesome possum. Ask away. Tell me more about James Olner. Say what? Him? How the hell do you know about him? He's a person of interest. You want dirt on him or something? Why go through me? Don't you have normal questions to ask? Like... No. What do you think of climate change? Or the state of social media shaping consumerism. You know. Normal questions. The A stands for anything. I pretty much asked you anything. Ugh, fine. If that's what you really want to know, only two conditions. First, tell me what you need the info on him for. He's a key witness in a disappearance. Sweet jeepers! I knew something was up. Oh god, I could have been kidnapped. So she didn't meet with him. Look, I'm not sure what you heard, but this sounds seriously effed up. If it's going to help someone else, I will tell you everything, but... This is between us. My second condition is that we keep this between us, okay? Sure, okay, whatever. It's a deal. Okay, let me start from the top. Please do! Please do. I keep my own persona keeping it Cassie and my real life separate. My real name is Cassandra. Keeping it Cassie has always been single. But I'm not. I had a long term boyfriend, but I was dumped. So I went on Spark and chatted with a few guys to get over it. That's when I met James. Did he act weird? Nothing at the beginning, actually. It started out fine, but he was a real charmer. Seemed to tell me the right things after coming off a shitty relationship. I was at a low place. He gave me perspective and plenty of good advice. This is the same as what he did for Anna. Then he started to get more things right about me. That sounds pretty creepy to me, yeah. That is nothing. Wait till you hear this. He starts to text me exactly when I finish work, my work. I don't have a regular schedule. They change every week, days even. But he somehow managed to text me exactly the right time. It was a photo shoot that ended at 2 a.m., he texts me the moment the photographer called it a wrap. Does he ever sleep? Okay, that is weird. Here's the final straw. He knew about the break, the the bake beak up breakup. I worked my ass off to keep my relationship a secret for the sake of keeping it Cassie, and somehow James knew. I confronted him, and he told me he guessed it. Look. Okay. What was the last time I heard from him? 
So did your online persona drive your boyfriend away? How the hell do you know about this? I took a guess. Guessing exactly when I wake up and fin when I finish work. That's plain creepy. Finding out about my jabber, my boyfriend, and this piece of sorcery. No one else knows about this. Who the hell are you? Are my methods too uncomfortable? We are... <laughs> to you too. We are done. Okay, so she blocked him. That's the last time I heard from him. That's all I need to know. Are my methods too uncomfortable? That's... That's pretty bad. That's... Almost like he's breaking a character or something. That's all I'm saying. Just thinking about him makes my hair stand. This is very helpful. Thank you, Cassie. I appreciate it. And you've done... You know, I read somewhere that psychopaths try their best to fit in. I feel James is kind of like that. Hope you get what you need. There's something off about him. I agree. Okay. So, we've spoke to Cassie. Uh, okay. Okay, Ashley. Let's talk to Ashley. She's really gone. I can't find her anywhere except that damn jammer post. It's like she disappeared from this earth. We're doing the best we can. Yes, Greg told me about teaming up with you. Much as I hate to call that asshole. Can we just go to the police already? We're almost there. I'm not sure the police can really help with this. The longer we wait, the harder it is to find her. The first 24 hours are crucial. I'm going to call them. That's not a good idea, trust me. And who are you to make the decision, huh? She is... I was with Anna for six years. Years, okay? We graduated together. Moved down to town together. Did everything together. Even had to watch her get messed up by that fucking Greg. I was there throughout all of it. Fuck other guys. I'm the only one who to treat her right. So don't tell me you decide what's best for Anna. Anna means a lot to you, huh? You have no idea. Fuck. What? I miss her. I know, Ashley. We'll sort it. I don't know what to do. Anna needs you to be strong, okay? We'll get through this, Ashley. I just... If anything happens to her... No, this can't wait any longer. I'm done with you. I'm calling the cops. You and Greg are in this. Both of you are going to... Ashley! Jesus Christ. Okay, we've got a new vlog. I tracked down Cassie. Yeah, did she kiss and tell? He can predict her every move. So he's either some next level stalker, or there is something that to him that we don't know. Never mind. We know James is maximum creep material. Creepy enough to kidnap Anna, perhaps. Have he called his workplace yet? Second opinion from a professional would be great. No, that's next on the list. That's next on the list. Anyway, we've got a new vlog as well. Okay. So, I'm gonna download Spark. Yes, online dating is happening. But I figure I deserve to be happy and forget about everything else. And there's no point wasting time. So, here I go. What's the worst that could happen? Oh. Uh... Okay. That's the worst thing to say. Worst thing to say ever. Okay, so we need to find out that guy's workplace. Um, okay, here we go. I found the website for Fresh Ideas now. It was in the Spark post. Now I just need to... Find a phone number. There doesn't seem to be one. I wonder if I fill in one of these, maybe. Mike Bobjoy and e what's Anna's email actually? What's Anna's email? Position copywriter. Okay, apply. Ah, okay, RE job application. Thank you. We'll send you an email shortly. Please ensure that email is correct to receive our invite. Okay. Ah, there we go. We've got an email. D 
Dear Anna, thanks for your interest in joining our ever-growing family. Before we commence the interview, is our policy to engage a preliminary chat with all our applicants beforehand. Please contact our HR to... Uh, okay, start interview. Hey, Phil! Your interview will start soon. Please wait. The conversation will be recorded for internal use. Fine. Come on, Phil. Not all day. Police are hounding me, you know. Howdy there, is this Anna? Uh, yes, this is me. Nito. I'm Phil. Hey, Phil! Some fresh ideas. Nice nice to meet you. Or Phil Fresh, as some of my buds call me. Get it, Phil? Yeah, yeah, fine. Whatever. This is just an informal chat, so just loosen up and save for the beginning of you later on. So you ready? Uh, can I ask a question instead? Not how this works, bud. You can ask the questions a little later. Okie dokie. Got it. Okay, sure. Fair enough. Coolio. Five years from now, what do you see yourself doing? Uh, develop the skills to manage other people. Gunner for manager, eh? Well, we're a tiny firm. Anything can happen in five years. Next question. Why should I hire you? Uh, I've learned stuff that m which might bring unique value. Mm, that's good. Glad to know what those stuff are. Last question. Why do you want to work here? James Olner spoke highly of you guys. Do you know him? James? Haven't heard that name in a while. Sorry, bud. Why are you asking this? So I won't repeat his mistakes. That's kind of forward thinking we're looking for. It's a shame, really. We had to let him go because of his unprofessional behaviour. Is there a misunderstanding? Being tactical about this, I really am not sure. To be frank, I'm not in the liberty to discuss any personal matters. All I could say socially, he was one of our best. He gets along with people well and generally likeable. But that kind of changed. What do you mean? What changed? He broke off with his girlfriend, of course he was upset, but he's still himself until he got spark. Since then, oh crap. He's been showing up late, he grew distant, then one day he just vanished. He didn't show up for work. My eyes might be deceiving me, but I was so, of, so sure of what I saw. He went into the bathroom for quite some time, then I heard a strange noise coming from it. I even recorded it. Listen. Oh, great. Okay. That's the same thing we heard in Anna's apartment. I was. I went in to check, and no one was there. That was the last time I saw anyone saw him in person. Yeah, this is almost too similar to the Anna situation. So he's just gone. Yep. So then he never showed up for work. So I don't think this is James. No phone calls, no emails, nothing. So we terminated him. Plus a big project coming up. We don't really need it right now. I understand. Fair enough. I'm going to be professional about this. What's weird is that after he disappeared, we found his phone on his desk. We tried checking it, but I think it was broken because it kept glitching out. So I'd say they still see him on... Oh, some say they still see him on Jabba, some female friends even saw him on Spark. Whatever happened to the kid, I think he needs help, professional help. Uh, no other questions. Whoa, sorry I went on off a tangent there. Thanks for the interview. We'll call you if you got the position. I don't think that's really going to be necessary, Phil. Okay. Okay. I called his workplace. Yep, fresh ideas, isn't it? What have you got for me? James, we're missing as well. No way. This kind of confirms what I found as well. Calling fresh ideas is a great plan. I think we've got some great leads. I think so too. Okay, you showed me yours. 
I'll let you show me mine. I want to see. I found something about James too. Freedom to alternative facts. Power through different truths. Educate yourself. What the fake mass media do not want you to see about the recent disappearances on dating apps. First of all, I want... Okay, apparently my account's been suspended for some reason. Okay. A big yellow line labelled missing and no one seems to bother mentioning this. Yeah, that's true. First one, Tracy P. Loves books and staying indoors. According to her best friend, after entering a long-term relationship with her high school sweetheart, she went on Spark. Three days later, she went missing. Okay. Simon, 24-year-old waiter. His room at home recently called off a long-distance relationship and wanted to try Spark. A couple of days later, he went missing. Next, Amy T. Developing James A. This is developing, so I don't have much to info on him. Here's what I could dig up. He's 25, works as a copywriter. Though he's technically missing, he's somewhat still active on Jabber, so no one has filed a report yet. But it didn't stop there. His phone was found in someone's backyard and handed to the police as evidence. Now this is where it gets weird. I know a guy who knows a guy who's gone through his phone. They found a weird video of him and huge chunks of data missing. This is what's going on here. Something strange is going on. We can't contact on the police and the government media for this. It's up to us. Girl, guy, girl, guy, and so on. Girl, g oh shit, okay. I'm next. Balls. They seem to be a bookworm of sort, either studying or working related jobs or YouTube or something like that. They all broke up recently with their girlfriend. Okay, that's fine. I don't count. I don't count in that. It's fine. Would anyone count? Maybe Greg? Shit, maybe they're after Greg next. Conclusion, I have no freaking clue, right? Trust no one. There's only us against them. That. You want me to read? I just read it, man. That's scary shit. Okay, I'll try and sum it up. I did read it. Too long, didn't read. James vanished a couple of months ago on the way out to, wait for it, meet someone from Spark. Just like Anna. There's more. Combine this with what you found out. I think there's something bigger at works here. Okay, I need to record this so we are on the same page. So, um... Commencing epic monologue. Okay. Anna went missing the same way as James. They were both last seen going on a date with someone on Spark. Anna and James still had activity on Jabber, but no one has physically seen them. It's the same pattern. James is still nowhere to be found. I hope Anna doesn't share the same fate. Maybe they've been sucked into the phones, into the internet, and it's something in the internet, like an entity that's taking them. You're right. I think he's right. I'm pretty sure he's right here. There are too many similarities between Anna and James for it to be a coincidence. Whatever that's happening right now is spooky as fuck. I agree. Go away. There is a poster going around making people disappear. I think he or she is assuming the identity of James. I'm going to find him and I think I know how. All right, let's hear it. Let's hear it, man. Let me just check something real quick. I'll get back to you. Oh, okay. Fine. Leave me in the lurch. Okay, what have we got? Oh, Greg. Right, okay. My Spark account was... You have logged into your Spark account from unknown. For security reasons, we have logged you out in all other authorized cases. So Spark is now gone. A no-go. Oh, we've got a new vlog, vlog, vlog thingy. Anna? She's there. She's in the shower. Anna? Anna. You there, don't jump scare me. Well, that was weird. Attack all. Yeah, did. Okay. Right, okay, so we've still got one video that's sinking on here. Right, okay, let's talk to Greg. God damn it, I'm hitting dead ends everywhere. It's like she vanished from the face of the earth. I'm getting closer. This is not a fucking competition. It's just... Greg, you two dickhead! I can't get anything done with the cops breathing down my neck. I can't be caught there the way things are now. They will think I'm the reason Anna is missing. Have they contacted you? 
Ashley ratted on you. How did she know? You told her, didn't you? Fuck, I warned you about this. They must be on their way to look for me. Fuck. You need to do me a favour. You cannot let them know about me. It might be good if you go with them. It'd be safe then. Okay, hey Greg. Buddy, pal, friend. You know I have nothing to do with Anna disappearing, right? You know what they do to guys like me in jail? Oh, I sure as hell don't want to find out. Look, if anyone asks, you gotta back me up. Thanks, Greg. Going to jail is not an option for me. I'm getting the fuck out of there. Fuck Anna. Oh! Really, Greg? I'm leaving this to you. Really? Greg, you fucker. Honestly. Okay, I got something. You're a Bugs Bunny fan. This is relevant because... I'm getting there. There are plenty of episodes where he will dress up like a girl to lure his enemies into traps. Classic. I see where this is going. You're thinking what I'm thinking. Mm-hmm. We need to lure this creep out. Just like Bugs Bunny. Bait him. Yes! What if we catch this imposter, A.K. James, in the act? If this is some creep luring victims on Spark, we should beat him at his own game. You know, like a TV where guys pretend to catch children online to catch be pretend to be children online to catch pedos. We could do the same. By we, you mean me. You do have a phone and stuff. Uh, I could give it a shot too. Use on a Spark account and edit into a new profile. Try to match with James. Set up a meeting. Then bust him from there. Yeah. Okay. Fine. We'll try it. Why not? If there's anything I learned from using Spark and watching TV and read almost all dating advice out there, you've got to be that person's type to get the better match. Be they who they like, huh? Yep. Everyone has their own tastes and types. All of those people who disappeared while using Spark shared something in common. Just make sure the profile you make contains the tags that are similar to them. I think I can make a guess. Yeah, I think I could do this. You're thinking what I'm thinking. The article I sent you is full of clues. You even spoke to Cassie. All of the missing people, Anna, Cassie, had to share something in common. You've got to find out what that is and make a profile with the correct tags. If I could do it, you can too. Just to be smooth as you are. <laughs> Way ahead of you. Oh, God. By the way, you might need these. Oh, okay. You're sending me pictures that I can use. Okay. Here are some pics you can use for the profile. As long as you don't use Anna's pics, it's fine. So You just have three women's photos lying around, man. You mean you don't? No. You don't have friends just sharing pictures of pretty girls with you. Uh, that's just creepy, man. No, I don't. Okay, this looks bad again. We can debate about this later. We are so close. Go to Anna's Spark profile and start creating. To catch the criminal, you've got to be the victim. Make sure your profile is similar to theirs. Okay, remember the secret in the tags. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Right, the Spark was... Okay, we've got to create a profile for me now. New vlog available. That's the last one. What? Rel Nissen Dismo Okay, I don't know what that means. Okay, let's do this, shall we? Okay. Upload photo. <sighs> okay, chat images. Which one do we pick? Um, well, I've got blonde hair, so we'll go for the blonde hair. Okay. Name. 
Michelle age 23 <laughs> work studies youtuber tagline <laughs> you be my player too <laughs> I'm a fun loving gal <laughs> I love staying indoors and reading and playing them sweet video games <laughs> okay okay we're gonna um <laughs> Oh, I was laughing too much about this. Okay, right. I've got to find out what was similar. Uh, oh, I've got to do it again. You're joking, right? Victims tend to be age 21 to 25. Girl, guy, girl, guy, so on. Bookworms. Studying or working in related jobs. Okay, so YouTuber probably wouldn't have worked. Okay, freelance. Writer, I oh, yeah. will you be my player to question mark about I love reading and watering my plants because I'm super interesting. I like books indoors. Um, finding love. Work and career. Oh, I need one more interest. Moving on. 99 matches near you. Okay. Albert. No. Bill. No. Mark. No. Stephanie. No. Jennifer. No. Danny. No. Bruce. No. We've met all these people before. Uh, Ruthie. I love memes. Yeah, that's... Uh, yeah. Hello, James. Yeah, we love. It's too late for me. Okay. I am no longer of this world. She could still be saved. Do not trust its words. Nothing is what it seems. Okay, this was the pictures he was sending me. He was actually on the building. Oh. oh. I've matched with Anna. Yay, let's start chatting with Anna. Hello, this isn't Anna. Is anyone there? Please answer me. I don't know where I am. Help. You're not Anna. What are you talking about? Of course I am. Please help. The last thing I remember, I was going out. I met James. This isn't Anna. Shit, I remember. He was standing on the roof. Is he okay? He fell down. Is he dead? I can't tell. What do you think I am? Forensic pathologist? I saw him, then I blacked out. you got to help me out of here. I think I was drugged. Where are you now? A warehouse. A building. I don't know. It's dark, I can't tell. I'm really scared. I've been trying to reach out. Thank God I found James's phone. You're lying. James's phone was found by someone else. I am not. I don't know. That's not important. I think I can help myself now. I have to get out and get help. Thanks for not giving up on me. I should go. I'm not letting this go. You are not Anna. Look at it. It's going greyer. It's going darker. And there's this thing in the middle. He told you, didn't he? You are not Anna. 
I am her as she is me. If it is me you wish to see, then so be it. Impressive. A worthy pretender. My perversion fails to deceive you. Yeah. You have seen through my mask. Apparently. Where is Anna, you dickhead? Anna, the original and the copy are now one. Momentarily. I am her as she is me. You rejected all of my warnings. Do you crave the truth so badly? Apparently. Your blind determination to save this female has led you to me. Apparently. Very tender. Dickhead. You've got some explaining to do, douche face. I am the simulacra. Oh, right, okay. Beyond your glass screens. Behind your black mirrors. Is a reflection of your reality. I am that reality. So it is basically what I said it was. It's a creature hiding within the internet, feeding on people. E you're in the phone. I am the new order and existence perfected. He's assimilating I am people. Society reshaped. The simulation destined for ascension. A hyper real existence. I just want to save Anna, you bitch. Irritating. Irritating. Your finite perception will be your own bane. The material society is fading. A digital one taking its place. What, you're running that on you? Where only perfect symbols of humanity exists. They're, on they're online personas. They're simulacrums. Anna. Many others like her has no place here. Why are you doing this? Anna is a worm. In a perfect image. That needs to be eradicated. A weak individual that only laments. A stronger individual would simulate a better one. In my world. In the online world. Not everything is about online personas, mate. Humans interact with their simulacrums. Almost exclusively detached from the material world. Finding labor, picking food, choosing habitats. Seeking mates without ever leaving the screens. Is that not everything? How about Anna? Weak simulacrums fade into obscurity, a waste of precious space. I assimilate them momentarily, make them stronger, seek other worms for removal, delete the original source from the material world. By killing them, right, okay. Like how you kill James. A worm that no longer exists. Yeah. Erased from the material world. A fate, Anna. So she's not she dead yet. The next worm. Taylor. The next one to be culled. You will not delay my simulation of him any longer. Oh, I thought he was going after Taylor. Let Anna go. You shall. Sympathy. Yes. For the life unlived. Human being. How you value one worm over the next will continue to elude me. Okay. No, Taylor. Anna told me she's gonna be here. Oh, Taylor, you dickhead. What are you doing? It's really weird. You might not even be here. You need to leave. Might be a trap. So, if it turns out to be a bunch of kidnappers or something, <sighs> tell the God world damn. that 
At least I tried. You need to get out of there, man. Okay. No, that's not Anna. We were looking for Anna this whole time and we found her. No, we didn't! Are you being a buzzkill? Did she say where she was all along? Well, duh. You had her phone. Also, she said someone else, I think she means you, was hogging her Spark account. When she finally remembered her password, she logged back in. You are going to be the next victim! Get out of there! I don't mean to brag. Oh, Taylor, no! But I have a green belt correct. That's not the point! I could take a. No! Maybe we jump to conclusions. Taylor, no! It's really Anna will find out there and then. I have to go get her. Don't go! Give me some time first, please, Taylor. Okay, okay. Sounds serious. But why? I'm gonna save your life, man. Okay. I think you're making this a little too dramatic. Just get back to me soon, okay? I'm just gonna text her that I will wait, okay? Okay, thank God. I think I, I think I saved him. Impressive. You continue to yes, I think I saved him. Stall the inevitable. Why waste your precious gift on such worms? Pretender. Shut up. Because you are wrong. Your ignorance is irritating. Your You're irritating. Words and actions are futile. My reach abides by no rules or order. I can erase the true Anna, the smooth, if I wish to do so. But you aren't because Distance you. Distance and contact will not hinder my assimilation. They don't need to die. The physical bodies of these worms are worthless. Their death only remains on the material world. Their symbols will be eternal in mine. That's just creepy, man. Oh, I think I can help you. I think I can help you. We're going to try and appeal to him. A worm underground will never comprehend the infinite sky. What can you show me that I don't already know? Oh. People can grow and improve. That's true. People can. Your blind faith in them continues to irritate me. Your attachment to your failing reality is short-sighted, soon to be replaced by the hyper-real. Who gives you that right, you piece of shit? The ascension of your world rests within me. A pure existence awaits. Untainted by the weak, a glorious utopia. Sounds like shit, mate. I will prove you wrong. You wish to change the fate of these two worms? I think I already have, my good man. I will send them without killing them. Be grateful of my offer. Choose Anna or Taylor for one to live. The no, that's not on. Finish. Can I save both? Please? You have nothing to offer. One worm for another. A fair trade, if events transpire differently, I might have considered. What events? The die is cast, and the cast 
must die. Who will it be? I have to make a decision. We've been looking for Anna this whole time, right? So I think Anna has so much to live for. I hate saying this, but I have to make a decision. I want to save Anna, let Taylor die. You wish to preserve the feeble girl. Amusing. Anna will be standing by a ledge. If Anna is the one you But we did get Taylor out of the way. Tell Taylor to go to her. Anna will be released, and Taylor will become my new host. If Taylor is the one you want to save, convince him to push Anna off and kill her body. I will remove myself from your lives. You monster. In the grand vision, these are just insignificant moments. Unworthy of remembering, Taylor is informed. Everything after this point is up to you. You bastard. Oh no. Hey, Anna texted me. I went to the location just in case. I know you told me to wait. You're not seeing the big picture. I spent some time to reflect on the way here. You're making... You're right, something isn't making sense here. The stuff about James and her disappearance. I just want to say... I think there is something bigger at work here. Yeah, the fucking duh. You seem to know more about it. Uh, even I'm still figuring it out, man. So, yeah. I just want to say, I trust you, okay? Whatever happens, I will listen to you. You've been backing me up all these times and it's only fair. Holy shit, it's Anna. What is she doing? She is by a ledge. She looks off. Something is off. The fuck? My hair is standing. Oh no, 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 no. I don't want to make this decision because I know. He trusts me as well. I don't want to do either. Because I know what the bottom one is and I know what the top one. I wonder if there's a way of pushing her down and him saving her. But that's really risky. I could risk her life there. Is it a long... Is it a big ledge? I guess I have to make my choice. You have to go to her. Shit! Ah! Oh! We did it. We found Anna. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Taylor. It was a team effort. I'm sorry, man. Fucked up. Definitely as she looks stressed. No matter. I'm gonna get her. Oh my god, I looked at her. That face. What is that smile? It's not right. What the fuck? Am I? Is this what Anna went through? Am I next? Taylor went offline. Hello. Hi. Uh, it's me, Anna. Hey. I'm free. Whoever you are, you saved me. But... But Taylor, he's... 
He's gone. Oh my god, it took him. Oh my god, it, it took him. It is done. Anna is released from my assimilation. She is free to go. Is Taylor okay? The assimilation will complete in a moment. It is as you intended. You intended, I you mean? I am Taylor, and Taylor is I. Anna will be spared. It's not worth it. This is not what I imagined. You choose one worm over another. They are still both worthless worms. Anna's material life will cease to be the same. Her will reshaped into my vision. What is going to happen now? I cannot allow her feeble life to exist. You her what? physical body will be returned while her simulacrum is integrated into her will. Is she alive or what? Your overvaluation of the material world perplexes me. Anna will serve as my avatar to learn more about your world. True Anna is gone. Only the symbol remain. No one will know the difference. You lied to me, you piece of shit. I only promise to keep her body alive and return it to you. I did not deceive Yes, you did. I pity you. It is your limited view that prevents you from seeing the grand vision. One day you will see the marvelous truth. You absolute bastard. That is never gonna happen. I'm gonna screw you up, mate. The worms is an ever expanding endeavor. You have shown me that some worms are worth saving. You and I are not that different. Oh, I think when we are. Time comes for your ascension into your simulacrum. I will guide you to your eternal glory. Go screw. Anna is offline. I can't do anything. Okay. Anna came to me. She, she came to me. It, it, it came to me. It looks like her, but it's something else. It looked at me. I don't feel so good. What the hell was that thing? It's getting a hold on me. On me. I, I can't breathe. I, I can't see. I have to move my my eyes. My eyes. I'm not Why am I being punished? I did, I did the right thing. I did everything right. It is me. Assignment. As it is me. Assignment. As it is me. Assignment. As it is me. Assignment. Assignment. I don't want to see anyone else. Help me. Me. Help me. I feel like I screwed up. <laughs> Saved Anna by sacrificing Taylor. <sighs> okay, so there's different endings. I don't know what type of ending I got, but you and 63% of players chose not to hurt Ashley's feelings. You and 41% of players helped Greg to escape the police. 
You and 64% of players did not report Merv sexual harassment. You and 63% of players got Taylor to trust your judgment. You and 82% of players did not turn Taylor into a murderer. I didn't want to turn him into a murderer. To save Anna, you allowed Taylor to be sacrificed. However, she might not be the same again. Is that what you intended? Simulacra has many Easter eggs and multiple endings. Play again and try for a different outcome. Yeah, I enjoyed the experience. That was a good game. Okay. I'll, I'll skip that for now. I'll, I will do that. Okay, thanks guys. Oh man. Oh. Okay, so it was pretty much how I thought it was going to be. That it was uh, an entity within over the internet or something that was basically assimilating people into it and then killing their physical bodies. You know, that being said, I did enjoy the game. I don't know if I... I don't think I did good there. I think I did. I think that wasn't particularly great. But then, to be fair, they all could have died. And I did get Taylor to trust me, even though I screwed him over, which I feel really bad about. Ah, uh, man. I don't think I'll go through and get any other endings. I think I'll probably leave it at this. But, uh... Let me know what you thought of this game in the comments below. I'd be interested to hear your thoughts. And uh, thank you for supporting this series. It's been a wild ride. Oh, begin plus. Okay. Does that make a difference? I don't know. But thank you everybody so much for watching. And I'll see you again soon.